Hey guys, I just got this laser sight. I'm excited to share with you. Just got it out of the package. It came with three batteries, as well as three of the uh, Allen wrenches you'll need to make the adjustments for each feature on it. And so I'll quickly put the batteries in. It's got adjustment here. Is this? Take this out real easily, and then I'll put the batteries in. All right, so there you have it. I have the batteries in, and you can see here is the battery area where those three little batteries go into, and then here is where the laser sight comes out of, and then you have an adjustment here for putting it on a rail, and then the adjustment here to put it on the Picatinny rail there. And then on the back of it, just real simple, I'll show you in a minute. You have this one little button, and you click it, and it turns it on, and you click it, and it turns it off. Very simple. One of the great things I thought about this was that they stand behind their product, meaning that if you have any issues, this is shock resistant, shock proof, and so if you have any issues, send it back to them and they will replace this. This is made out of solid aluminum alloy and it comes in matte black, which looks really great on it. With it being so small, of course some concerns would be the windage and elevation. They do have that cover. Here you see on this side, I'll give you a close up, but there's a little hole here where one of the Allen wrenches, the smallest one, goes in and you can adjust the windage in elevation. This is for the, the top is for the elevation. There's one here for elevation and this is for the left and right on the side. So here you have it. On the side you have that adjustment screw in there, that little hole. And then on the top here the adjustment screw is that little one right there. And there you see laser sight on this side and battery on that and it comes with a allen wrench and you just stick it in there unscrew that and put the batteries in for replacements and then on the back a simple laser button you should be able to see that on the couch and then you can click it off click it back on very bright very visible and will really come in handy in those low light situations where you'll need it. All right, that's it. I'm excited to put this to use and get some practice with it out on the shooting range to get it all sighted in. 